cold and wet out and lambs with mothers can get a sup of warm milk. Emily, being a bottle baby, can't. So I'm going to bring her in. These guys aren't happy I'm chasing them out from under the tree. I don't know where Ebony is. See, there you go. A lamb getting a nice sup of milk from Willow, one of her babies. There's both her twins sticking close to her. And they will get lovely little tot-ups of warm milk. Whereas Ebony has no mother. Only me. Tree hugging. There's Ebony under this tree, sheltering under the branch with a whole bunch of other years, but she's standing and looking cold, so I'm gonna bring her in. Ebony! Come on, baby! Come on! Atta girl! Come on, Ebony! Clever girl! We're gonna get you cozy! We're gonna bring you in and get you cozy. It's not fair. Come on, Ebs. Come on, girl. Willow with her two lambs. They'll be fine with her because they'll get their warm sups of milk. Ebony stopped at this tree because she said she didn't want to go any further in the rain. You can see she's kind of humped up and cold. So I'll pick the wee one up and carry her in and she'll get thawed out at the aga, get a sup of milk, and then I'll put her in the back in the shed where she's sheltered because she can't get that odd sup of warm milk. Come on, Ebony. Come on. Yes, baby. Okay, Ebsters. Oh, we're going to pick you up and we're going to carry you in. Come on, boys. Come on, Ebs. Let's go in. Don't want double pneumonia, do we? No. I think she's happy that her little bit of milk warm up her insides from that cold, breezy rain. See your little tail wiggle. Getting into Pepper's food bowl. I think we're feeling warmed up now. You're being cheeky. Cheeky. 
Kiki. Oh, the Met snoozing on top of the Aga. Got hay, access to hay. There's our water, which I'll clean out. It's got hay that was dragged into it. And then she'll have some nuts. Mm. Yummy. Clean water, plenty of hay chomping on the nuts the lovely red heat lamp to keep her warm out of the rain <laughs>